color. Green's going to represent land. What other colors going to represent land? White shows us that. If there's two different colors, it means there's two different things going on here. Tell me what could be on the green area making it green. We are in the Africa. We're in the water. <laughs> Stay in your line, so. No, we're good for a step. find Africa where we first started. Can you point to it? Ta -da, there it is. There's the Sahara. There's the Nile. There's the forested areas. And you can even see the delta here at the end. Oh, it's something that happens when the forests and the grasses get too dry. Forest fires? Forest fires, yeah. A lot of Australia, a huge percentage of Australia was having... There's Maryland and Brisbane. Hi, Perryville. Hi, Perryville. Now, if you had never, ever, ever visited Maryland before. If you had never come to Maryland before, what's something you could tell me about it just by looking at the colors? Yeah, it gets rain. Do we get rain in Maryland? Yeah. We sure do. It's not very bumpy. So what does that tell you about the shape of the land? It doesn't have a lot of mountains. Is that true? Yeah, it's true. And it's